it has been a really exciting time here at the show. We, we have had the coral announcement, and we've got disclosures on our new data-centric design. And here I'm standing in front of our pedestal for our newly announced uh, DCS3860 product. This is the third in our successful line of DCS products, and we've sold this product line to thousands of technical computing customers, oil and gas customers, media and entertainment customers around the world. This product adds a great deal of performance and capability to the family, which comprises the DCS3700, DCS3700 with performance modules, and even our V3700 products. Now, this is a controller-based architecture, and the controllers combined with our GPFS elastic storage software are tuned and key for the, the advanced performance and data management requirements that technical computing customers have as they advance from the Terra scale to the Peta scale and even to the Exascale. This product is even a core component of one of our new analytics MapReduce workflow systems. We're now going to go on a little adventure to another part of the booth and hunt for new solutions down low on the show floor. We're standing and kneeling in front of our new Elastic Storage Server. This is the newest member of our Elastic family on our data-centric systems family. Let's take a quick look inside. This shares a lot with the DCS3860, but we've actually removed the controllers and we've directly connected these drives to the power servers here. And these power servers, using their high bandwidth and their ability to process lots of data, do all of the RAID work that was formerly done by controllers. We have a large SAS backplane that goes into the drives themselves, and we have, in this case, a model GL2. It's two power servers and 116 drives, and the L and the 2 stand for large enclosures with two drives. We can scale these in a building block approach and add a building block, a GL2, a GL2, a GL2, a GL2, and make our way all the way up to, to, to large petascale systems. We also have uh, configurations with four enclosures and six enclosures, up to 348 drives, being controlled and driven by the power servers in a unique declustered RAID approach so that we don't have to worry anymore about drive rebuild times or performance impact using old-fashioned RAID techniques. We can deploy these in our IBM Data Engine for Analytics as our map reduced storage without the need for the old-fashioned triple replication of disk. We've got the performance, we've got the bandwidth, and we've got the scalable namespace to grow as customer needs evolve. I'm looking forward to talking to you again on our next adventure on the factory floor. Thanks for listening.